Despite having a net worth of over $220 billion, business tycoon Elon Musk doesn't make it to the list of the richest people in history, which means that even Amazon's Jeff Bezos and Microsoft's Bill Gates don't cut as well. It's crucial to keep in mind, though, that the further in time we go, the more difficult it is to determine an individual's relative wealth because things were different back then. Gold, land, salt, and power were the main sources of wealth, however not all academics agree on how to value these things. But after taking into account inflation and the value of commodities at the time, we've done our best stocktaking and determined that, in 2022 dollars, these individuals are the richest humans to have ever lived. In this video, we will be looking at the top 10 richest people to ever walk the earth. Welcome back ladies and gentlemen and thank you for joining us. If you are new to this channel, do well to like and share the video and hit that subscribe button to join our channel. Number 10, John D. Rockefeller. One of the richest people in history, John D. Rockefeller was an American business titan and philanthropist. Rockefeller accumulated a huge fortune between 1839 and 1937, mostly thanks to his leadership in the oil sector. He revolutionized the oil refining and distribution industry as the founder of the Standard Oil Company, achieving levels of prosperity never before seen. Due to the size of his wealth and the several eras in which he lived, determining Rockefeller's net worth in modern terms is a difficult undertaking. But in today's money, his estimated net worth at the height of his career was $340 billion. Rockefeller's riches allowed him to rise to prominence in society, and he used it to finance several charitable projects, including the founding of the Rockefeller Foundation. His charitable work left a lasting impression on healthcare, scientific research, and education, solidifying his reputation as one of the most significant individuals in both business and philanthropy. Number 9, Andrew Carnegie. One of the richest people in his era was Scottish-American manufacturer and philanthropist Andrew Carnegie. Carnegie, who was born in 1835 and died in 1919, made the bulk of his money in the American steel business during the Gilded Age. Carnegie's net worth was reportedly around $372 billion in today's money during the height of his career. Through his management of Carnegie Steel Corporation, which eventually took control of the American steel industry, he amassed enormous riches. But Carnegie stands out for his extraordinary charitable work. He committed himself to donating the majority of his riches for the benefit of society after retiring from business. The building of many libraries, funding for education and science, and the advancement of international peace through programs like the Carnegie Endowment for International Peace were just a few of Carnegie's charitable endeavors. Number 8, Catherine the Great. From 1762 until her passing in 1796, Catherine the Great, also known as Catherine II, ruled as the Empress of Russia. Because of the distinct economic and political climate of the period, it is difficult to determine Catherine the Great's net worth in modern terms, but she was unquestionably a wealthy and powerful monarch. Significant geographical expansion, economic reforms, and cultural achievements in Russia occurred under Catherine's rule. She accumulated her money through land holdings, trade, taxation, and the exploitation of the Russian Empire's abundant natural resources. Catherine the Great had a passion for culture and art, and she gathered a sizable collection of works of literature, painting, and other cultural relics. She also made investments in the building and remodeling of opulent palaces, notably the renowned Catherine Palace in Tsarskoye Selo. The Russian monarch inherited and controlled a vast network of land, wealth, and political power, after assuming the throne in 1762, investments worth 5% of Russian GDP, or the equivalent of $1.5 trillion today. Number 7, Augustus Caesar. From 27 BC until he died in 14 AD, Augustus was the ruler of the Roman Empire, which was one of the biggest and wealthiest empires in history. He had access to the wealth of the occupied lands, the war booty, and the income from taxes and trade. Numerous properties, including huge estates in Italy and other countries, belonged to Augustus. Various mines and important resources, including agricultural goods and precious metals, were also under his control. In addition, Augustus had the support and financial backing of a huge network of aristocratic families and allies, which increased his economic clout and influence. While it is challenging to estimate Augustus Caesar's exact net worth, it is certain that he was incredibly wealthy and in charge of the Roman Empire's economic resources, making him one of the most influential and wealthy people of his era. His estimated net worth is $4.6 trillion. Number 6, Joseph Stalin. 
Joseph Stalin, the Soviet Union's dictator from the middle of the 1920s until he died in 1953, did not amass a large personal fortune like some other historical personalities. Stalin was more concerned with establishing his political ideology and gaining control than he was with accumulating personal fortune. Stalin promoted communal resource ownership and economic redistribution as the head of a communist state. He advocated for a government-controlled system of ownership of economic resources. Stalin had considerable authority over the Soviet Union's resources, including its vast industrial and agricultural sectors, but it's vital to remember that his position was primarily political and not based on riches. In contrast to pursuing personal fortune, his top priorities were the development of the state and the implementation of his policies. As a result, it is challenging to put a monetary value on Joseph Stalin because his influence and authority came more from his political position than from his financial success. His net worth, however, is estimated to be $7.5 trillion by some sources. Number 5, Empress Wu. Empress Wu Zetian, who ruled China from 690 to 705 AD during the Tang Dynasty, is renowned for her political acumen and tenacity. However, because of the historical background and scarcity of relevant records, it is difficult to estimate her net worth in modern terms. Wu Zetian ruled over the Tang Dynasty, one of the most affluent and potent empires in history, and was in charge of its enormous wealth and resources. She had access to the money the empire made from taxes, trade, and its enormous landholdings. Wu Zetian was probably an empress with priceless possessions like art, jewels, and precious metals. She also retained authority over the vast treasure that had been amassed over generations in the imperial treasury. However, it's crucial to remember that Wu Zetian's influence and power came more from her position in politics and her capacity for exercising authority than from her fortune. Her total wealth was estimated to be $16 trillion. Number 4, Akbar I. Abu El Fath Jalaluddin Muhammad Akbar, popularly known as Akbar the Great, was the third emperor to rule the Mughal Empire from 1556 to 1605. Akbar ruled over a huge empire that covered a sizable chunk of the Indian subcontinent during his reign. He had access to the riches produced by trade, taxes, and the Mughal Empire's resources, which included mines, farms, and a variety of businesses. He amassed a total estimated net worth of $21 trillion. In addition to building imposing constructions like the well-known Red Fort in Agra and Fate Per Sikri, Akbar supported the arts. Along with this, he made investments in the development of roads and irrigation systems, among other infrastructure projects. But it's crucial to remember that rather than coming from personal wealth accumulation, Akbar's power and influence came mostly from his ability to govern and his political standing. Number 3, Emperor Shenzong. From 1022 to 1063, Shenzong was the ruler of the Song Dynasty in China. As an emperor, Shenzong commanded the Song Dynasty's enormous wealth and resources, one of the richest eras in Chinese history. Trade, taxes, and agricultural output all helped the empire and added to its financial prosperity. Under Shenzong's rule, there was a notable surge in the economy, progress in technology, and developments in culture. The Song Dynasty was renowned for its highly developed bureaucracy, active trading networks, and innovations in printing, manufacturing, and agriculture, among other fields. Historians assert that the kingdom's centralized system of government, technical advancements, and efficient tax collecting put it light years ahead of European kingdoms in terms of riches. Shenzong accumulated riches that are estimated to be worth $30 trillion. Number 2, Genghis Khan. From 1206 until he died in 1227, Genghis Khan ruled. Genghis Khan's military victories and the enormous lands he subjugated for the Mongols were the sources of his strength and clout. A sizable area of Asia, including Central Asia, China, and parts of Europe, was included in the Mongol Empire. The richest calculates that he would have been worth nearly $120 trillion in today's currency since he built the greatest empire in history, which spanned much of China and Central Asia during his lifetime and as far as Poland and Vietnam later. Number 1, Munsa Musa. Munsa Musa, the West African king of the Mali Empire in the 14th century, is considered by many to be among the richest people in history. The Mali Empire's abundant resources and control over gold mines were the main sources of Munsa Musa's wealth. Musa's wealth was partly derived from his control over the profitable gold trade routes, as the empire was a major producer of gold. 
His reputation as an extraordinarily wealthy ruler was further cemented by his extravagant acts of generosity, such as constructing mosques and providing support to scholars. While celebrity net worth has been estimated his wealth to have been the equivalent of around $400 billion, historians believe it's virtually impossible to conclude the real number. This concludes our list of the 10 richest men of all time. Thank you for watching to the end. Please do well to leave a review and comment on what you think about this video. Until next time, stay safe.